Hello, uh, this is Steve from CuttingEdgeData.com and today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on what I have found to be the easiest way to import SVG files into Easel if there are embedded images. So I'm a real fan of Easel. I think it's a, an incredibly easy way to, to make G-code for your CNC machine. Uh, however, if you have an SVG file uh, that you're trying to you know, convert, if it has those embedded images, well, Easel can't open that. So I'm going to give you an example. I, I made this grayscale image and saved it as an SVG using Inkscape. And I tried saving it a couple different ways, uh, even using the most uh, plain version that Inkscape offers. And when I go to import that, we get the error message that pops up saying that uh, there are embedded images. And so what's going to be the easiest way to get rid of that? Well, here's what I found is that uh, there are times when Inkscape isn't open. On my machine, it takes several seconds to open. Um, what's going to be the easiest way? So here's that file. I'm just going to open it up in a text editor. It opens that quickly. I'm going to scroll down until I find the embedded image. There it is. So I'm going to look for the, the less than symbol that indicates the beginning of this section and this slash greater than symbol that, that shows the end of the section. And I'm just going to highlight all of that and delete it. And now I will do a save as. I'm going to give it the same file name, except I'll add something like text edit so that I can tell the difference between the file that I have just modified and the original. I'll save it. And now we go into easel. We hit import. We'll import the new one that we just removed the image from. And there we go. We've got the grayscale SVG in here now. And we get those nice depth waves that we want. There's probably many ways to do this, but for me, just opening it in a text editor was the fastest, easiest. And uh, you know, if you ever download an SVG from the uh, internet and you don't even have a, a vector graphics editor, um, no sweat, just open it in a text editor and uh, get rid of the embedded images and Bring them into easel. So I hope this helps somebody. Uh, have a great day. Thank you. Bye-bye.